In a world where everything is unscripted, this is Roasty Toasty Ghosty. Oh. Hello. Hello. Yeah, okay. Yeah, it's good. Do you ever get like sores on your gums? Like a little blister or something? Yeah. I have uh, two. Right now. Mm, I'm having trouble eating my chocolate. Yeah. Like, I want to, but it hurts. It's so good, but yeah, it's not nice. I cleaned up a bit in here. I don't know if you noticed. Yeah, I did. Really nice. Thank you. I kind of miss the Christmas stuff, but it has to go. At some point, yeah. Yeah. My dad is the same now. He always, like, puts out the Christmas stuff, and then he's really fast with taking them mm. away, too. I'm like, can't we wait, like, a few days? Mm. Nope, the, everything is gone now. Okay. Well, I try to put things out, like, December 1st, and then I take things down, like, a week after New Year's. Okay. <laughs> I thought you meant the week after December 1st. <laughs> it's up for a week. That's yeah, it. Yeah. Not, no Christmas. Christmas is over. Yeah. Not even over Christmas. It's just before Christmas. All right, Matias. Ready? All right. Yeah. Ow. Why are cans hard to open? Ugh. I don't know. I have to make sure the micro- mic- microphone gets it. Yeah, you can even hear the bubbles. Bubbly, bubbly. Let's do this. Okay. And I'm sleeping. Oh. That was quick. Mm. Are we going to start this? Yeah. Okay. Hello. Hello. And welcome to Roasty Toasty Ghosty. Yes, yes. welcome. Your favorite podcast. It is. With two of the best people. Okay. Ever. Oh. Have you met them? No, I well, don't think so. I'm Lauren. Oh, hello, Lauren. Hello. I met you. You no, you're Matthias. Oh. Not funny. Okay, got it. Wait, uh, wait, wait, what, what did I say? I met you. I uh, met you. I met, met you. At you. I met you. I I'm met you. I met you. <laughs> oh, I get. I guess. All right. No, yeah. say that again. <laughs> and I'm Matthew. No, you're Matthias. Oh. <laughs> No, it's funny. Yeah. You made it funny. Okay. I'm not funny. <laughs> Here we go. Vroom. You know what? What? This episode will be called Pity Party. We're both gonna say how bad we are and feel sad for ourselves. This is a funny podcast. <laughs> yeah. So, Matias, hey. you sound good. Thank you. How you feeling? Uh, I'm... No, you're not. Be honest. That's what I was. Okay. <sighs> yeah, I'm, I'm trying to survive. All right. That's what I'm doing here. So, yeah, I'm okay. I've been worse this week. I can say that. So I'm better, but I'm still not a hundred percent. I'm not a hundred persons yet. You're just the one. Yeah. What's funny about persons, I've heard the word persons and seen it written, I don't know where, but on several occasions. And I'm like, is persons a word or is it people? I'm not sure, really. No. I'm pretty, I feel like persons is a word, but it, I don't it, know. It feels wrong. The appropriate, that. like, context it no. should be. Yeah. yeah, I don't know. I don't know, but you're not really feeling well. No, well, no, maybe not really. Mm, okay. I've had a cold this week, so I'm not 100% back to my normal Matthias. That's why I'm Matthew. Okay. <laughs> You're Matthew when you're not 100% Matthias. Yeah. All right. I guess that makes sense. <laughs> okay. I'm sorry. Are you okay there? Yeah. How are you? Oh, by I'm, the way. I'm good. I'm mm. okay. Thank you. I'm tired. It took me a while. It took you a while to figure out your line, but um, <laughs> I'm glad you remembered it. Yeah. I didn't even have to tell you. No. Yeah. I'm tired. I took a sip of energy drink and now i'm ready for bed i'm guessing your week wasn't very productive <laughs> no not the first few days i've been home and feeling sorry for myself the first few days okay are we gonna go through the week i'm trying to remember what happened last weekend i think i stayed home yeah i did not see you on saturday no so we didn't go to the gym maybe the gym was closed because it was a red day oh yeah 
Yes. Yeah, I don't really remember. I guess I just hung out with the kids. Yeah. And I went to work on Monday. My gymnastics group that I teach started on Tuesday. So that was fun. Mm -hmm. And then Wednesday, I also went to work. But I got to leave early because my daughter had a haircut appointment. Oh, okay. So we went to that. And then I picked up my passport because I'm Swedish citizen now. Wow. Very cool. Yes. Yeah. And I have to tell you something. Okay. We just set a goal for the year. Right? Yeah. And I'm already failing so bad. Me too. Yeah. I picked up my daughter and I was like, I have a really big problem. And she started freaking out. And she's like, what is it? Mm. I was like, I need to get some candy right now. Yeah. <laughs> She got so annoyed with me because she thought it was an emergency. Mm. Like, it is an emergency. Yeah. So I, uh, I'm having some sugar issues. Uh, yeah, it's a problem. It is. It is. I can see myself, see my fat just grow mm -hmm. in the mirror. I feel it. Yeah. I'm like, I'm getting rounder and rounder every day. <laughs> round, round, getting <laughs> Yeah. Round, round, getting round, I getting round. <laughs> And then yesterday was Thursday. Yeah. You went back to work. I did. Mm -hmm. I also worked. Yeah. And today is Friday. Hmm. We work today, too. Yeah. How's it going? Right now or uh, at work? Yeah, at work. I mean, it's okay. It was a long day today, I think. I felt worse today than I did yesterday. No. Oh. That's not good. No. I hope I can feel better soon. Hopefully tomorrow. That would be good. Yeah. Who knows? Mm. I hope that I'm not, like, contagious or anything like that. I shouldn't be, right? I don't think so. No. I mean, aren't you contagious for the first few days? Yeah, before. Or the, even before, yeah. Yeah, like. I think you're okay. Yeah, I hope so. Right, today's Friday. Mm. It's January 12th, 2024. Okay, yeah. In case you didn't know. I did know that. Okay. But I still said, okay. Yeah. Like, I had no clue. Right. So it's Friday. Yeah. Do you know what that means? Movie night. Right. Would you like to movie on? Yeah. All right. Today, we watched The Foreigner. Yes. And West Side Story. From? 1951. Almost. Uh, you said the 51 one. I said 61. 61? Yeah. Okay, 1961. Mm. All right. I'm sorry. Yeah, I'd rather you didn't correct me. <laughs> I preferred it being 51. Okay, yeah, let's... It sounded better. Yeah, let's go with that, actually. But then that's wrong, so I can't do that. Well, that's it's 61. One. Okay, yeah. that's okay, I guess. Good. The Foreigner. Yeah. This is a movie with James Bond. Yeah. Yeah. That's James Bond. Yeah. <laughs> Pink James Bond. <laughs> yeah. Pierce Brosnan. Yeah. James Bond. And Jackie Chan. Yeah. Yeah. That is true. Yes, it is. Yeah. And it's directed by Martin Campbell, who directed Goldeneye and Casino Royale. So he's also a Bond. Yeah, he's a... Bond uh, director. Two, yeah, two-time. He's a two-timer Bond director. That's a mouthful. Yeah. <laughs> two-timer Bond director. <laughs> Bond director. <laughs> Yeah, that should be that should be the the title for the instead of director, it should be corrector. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Or if it's like correcting you. Yeah. If the first director gets fired, then the second one should be the corrector. Yeah, that makes sense. Yeah. So the foreigner in this movie, Jackie Chan has a daughter and she dies. So Jackie is sad. And Pierce Brosnan is mayor? And, yeah, he's a minister. Minister? Of, of some... Ireland? Yeah. Or some, of some he's, sort. I, he, I... He's in the government. Yeah. He's powerful and stuff. And he's not very nice. No. He's not nice to people. Jackie 
gets very threatening towards Pierce Brosnan because he wants the names of the people who killed his daughter. That's it. Yeah, that's it. That's all you have to know. Yeah, I mean, it's complicated. (laughs) Yeah. You should see the movie if you want to see what's... You should. You know why? Because I enjoyed the movie. Yeah. I wish that Pierce Brosnan's character was slightly nicer. Yeah. Just slightly. Some of the things he was saying and doing was a bit unnecessary. Yeah. But yeah, that is true. Just slightly. But it wasn't the worst character, though. He actually didn't want the terrorist attacks to happen. Mm. He wanted to get the terrorists. Yeah. I was almost going to say, did the deed. But <laughs> he wants to get the people who did the deed. But He's going to have to pick. There's a <laughs> lot of them. Yeah. He did the deed himself. Yeah. To people. another woman who wasn't his wife. <gasps> and then when she cheated, that was... That was okay. <laughs> it was less of a big deal. Yeah. That was really weird. Yeah. Anyway, I did enjoy the movie, though. Mm. How did you feel about it? I do really like this movie. It's the latest Jackie Chan movie I've seen in cinema, because there hasn't been any other Jackie Chan movies in cinema after this one. Sweden? In, yeah, in Sweden. Around here. That's why mainly. I really like this one. It's based on a book called The Chinaman, written by Stephen Leather. I think that's his name. I read the book before this movie was released, and I was concerned about a few things in the book that I didn't really like, and the good thing about this movie is that they skipped all those parts without spoiling anything. There was the one scene from the book that didn't make it to the movie that I thought in the book it was kind of exciting, so I was kind of hoping it would make it to the movie, but it didn't. It was, you know, when Jackie's in the woods having his backpack. He has this, like, bomb inside his backpack, and it gets, like, on a timer, so he is supposed to plant it somewhere, and then the guys jump him, the bad guys, Pierce Brosnan's guys. He has to fight Fight them and at the same time having the bomb that soon is going to blow in the backpack. That would have been cool to see in the movie too, but it wasn't. So still like the movie though. That's that. That's that. Then what did we watch? We watched West Side Story. And yeah, it's a musical. And I don't know a lot of the actors in this movie. It's no. probably too old for me. The girl who played Maria. Natalie Wood. I've heard of her before, but that's because of her death. Oh. Uh, Yeah. She died from drowning in 81, like 20 years after this movie. And she was 43. People think that it was her husband who drowned her. But it's all speculation. Yeah. It was first seen as an accident, and then people, you know. Mm. I don't know anything about that, but that's like the only thing I know about her. And I didn't even know she was in this movie until I read her name. I'm like, oh, I know that name. (laughs) Oh, so that's her. She's dead. Mm, Yeah. (laughs) That's too bad. Yeah. Do you want to tell me about the movie? Yeah. It's a musical. They sing. It's about like turf wars or what what would you call it? Gangs. Two rival gangs that are in like a war and then one of the gang members and the sister to one of the other gang's members. The sister and the gang member fall in love and it gets complicated. That's pretty good. Yeah. It's like Romeo and Juliet, right? Mm. In a way. Did you read that one? No. Okay. I mean, I know about the story. Mm. A couple of memorable songs. Two of them that okay. I already knew. I've heard them before. Okay. And that's the... America. That oh, one. Okay. I don't even know what it's called. America, I guess. And then it was... I feel pretty. Oh, so pretty. Yeah. That one. That was the one that I recognized. Yeah, okay. But that was it. Yeah. And I'm still thinking... Where did I hear that song before? 
I feel pretty, oh so pretty. Uh, has it not been in commercials? Maybe, but I I feel like it's a movie. I don't know. No, if it comes up, I will tell you. How did you feel about the movie? I don't know. It wasn't the best. I know you thought it was long, and I agree, it was a long one. Maybe not my favorite. I wouldn't say it was really bad, but it's very, like, in the middle. It wasn't necessarily bad. There's definitely been worse. Uh, I just, I got kind of bored. Yeah. I mean, there was a lot of songs that just, all right, this... Yeah. That's enough. Yeah, I only woke up a bit more when when the songs I already knew, mm. when I heard them, I'm like, oh, this I know, and I, like I when, can listen to this. And then when the action started up, then I paid attention more, Yeah, but all of the like more... I don't know, dull moments in between. I yeah, like all right, yeah, that's enough. But I mean, um, what? Please, what is so important? You have to. I'm kidding. I'm sorry. Okay. What? I'm sorry. Yeah, I know. I uh um no, I don't remember. This movie is a classic, though. It is. On that note, I had no clue what it was gonna be about okay like i've heard of the title yeah i'd heard of the songs i didn't know that the two were related no and i assumed that it would be like a a cowboy movie okay yeah (laughs) i always assumed that but no it's not no i thought it was gonna be more of but maybe that's because i kind of mix it together with sound of music that it was gonna be about second world war you know nazis Mm -hmm. and stuff Okay. But that's probably just my brain mix it up with uh, the sound of music instead. Because I, I never seen that before we watched it. Yeah. So I think it's, in my head, all of the musicals just bunch together. Yeah. <laughs> as one. And also, these gangs were supposed to be, like, really cool. And they dance like that. I mean... Like ballerinas. <laughs> yeah. The, yeah, those aren't the cool guys. I, I can tell you that. I don't buy that for one second. I also want to tell the people about the beginning, which was this weird picture of a bunch of lines <laughs> yeah. that changed colors. It went on for ten for, minutes. Yeah, at probably. Least. <laughs> and then it comes in with these really cool guys snapping their fingers yeah. and then dancing like strangely. Ballerinas. Ballerinas, yeah. yeah. Not a favorite. No. No. But no. we're gonna see the remake too. Yeah, we can do that. That's what's uh, on the list for next week, unless oh, you want to. yeah, well, if it's on the list, then we can do that. Yeah. <laughs> what year is that one? 2021. Oh, all right. Yeah, I, I can. Directed by that. Steven Spielberg. Not the other guy? No. No? Okay. What other guy? The the one yeah, who directed the... this one. Oh no. Okay. I think it's dead. Okay. So maybe he drowned too. I don't know. Yeah, maybe. Maybe they all drowned. <laughs> yeah. Maybe her husband went around and drowned everyone in everyone. the cast. He's like, I hate that movie. <laughs> <laughs> this is so dark. Yeah. I think you need to take a break. Mm. I'm not gonna go for a long one today. I'm gonna rush through everything. Okay. So we're gonna take a break and And we'll be back in five seconds. Okay. Cool? Yeah. Cool. Bye. Bye. I know moms. Yeah. They throw everything away. Yeah. They don't get what's cool. No. My mom just threatened to throw things away. She, like, never actually My did. mom. Yeah, my mom. She doesn't care. Okay. She she doesn't even care if I like it or not. She, okay. This is trash. Poof. Yeah. Gone. Yeah, no. She would threaten to throw our things away. She actually did throw stuff away once, oh. but... I mean, they were CDs, so of course I ran out and saved the CDs. Yeah. Because that's me. Yeah. <laughs> like, you can't do that. Mm. <laughs> Matthias. <laughs>
Yeah. Welcome back. Thank you. Are you excited to be here? Yeah. Are you ready to go home? Yeah, whenever this is over. Yeah, me too. I've got some news for you, and you're going to really like it. Okay. Tomorrow we have live Mad Libs. Oh, yeah. And you're going to feel great it's for that gonna one. going to be great being <laughs> sick for that. <laughs> But I'm going to be here. It's going to be Sick People Are Boring Part 2. So, let's do two Mad Libs. Keep it quick. Yeah, okay. I'm going to do one, and then you're going to do one. Or do the writing. I have a challenge, though. Okay. I'm going to make these Mad Libs a little bit fun. Oh. Okay? I'm going to theme them. The words that you pick have to be sick related. Okay. Okay? Yeah. Okay. Good luck. Okay. Thank you. Verb. Coughing. Or cough. My pen is broken. Hold on. It's cracked. Oh, that's a problem. Yeah. A place. A hospital. Noun. Tissue. Plural noun. Pills. Number. 112. Or should that's... I say 911? Okay. Yeah. Well, you pick. Okay, 112. But I I can say that's like the Swedish version of 911. Yeah, correct. <laughs> Good Thank job. You. you didn't even Five have points to for you. Me. No, because you already knew. Yeah. Type of liquid. Oh. <laughs> it's so easy to go with snot, but um, You can. Yeah. Mucus? Is that? Oh, yeah. Same thing, just yeah. sounds worse. Yeah. Plural noun. Plural noun. Wait. Sick related. Sick. What's more? What do you use when sick? You Person, place, or thing. Yeah, I. Oh, yeah, doctors. Animal. <laughs> Sick animal. <laughs> I mean. I don't know. Do Do you have some sick animal that you think of? It wasn't one of the misfit toys that wasn't some kind of sick mm. animal or something. No, uh, fish who. Uh... He couldn't swim, but he could fly. Oh, yeah. But I'm sorry for uh, just uh, abandon that. Mm -hmm. Uh, Yeah, go ahead. Is it llamas that spit? Yeah. Yeah, let's go with llamas. Okay. Because they spit. That's, it's like they cough up. It's almost like they're coughing. Yeah. Adjective. Adjective. Runny. Part of the body, plural. Nostrils. Animal. (laughs) No, what? I'm I'm thinking now. I'm thinking of a Swedish word, but I don't know. Okay. Uh, it's not an am- animal. It's an insect. But you know, spiefluga. Uh, I don't know what that is. I don't think. What's that? Yeah, that sounds gross. No, uh, in English, it would be puke fly or vomit yeah. fly. But I've it's, never heard of that. No, okay. They, they when they land, they puke. Uh huh. So they're not nice. Are they here? Yeah. Oh. They they like to be around feces and okay. stuff like that. So they're that's not like even... regular flies, are they? I don't know. Yeah, kind of. Or they are a little bit like um, shinier mm-hmm. usually. I think very gross. Yeah. Yeah, I don't know. Uh, let's just say fly. Can I say fly? Mm-hmm. It's not an animal, but it's an insect. So. Do you allow that? Yes, I'll take it, because I already wrote it. Okay. Part of the body. Throat. Uh, noun. A noun. Syringe? Mm-hmm. Animal. Again. <laughs> wow. Cow. All right. <laughs> Just because. Yeah. A first name? Um. Okay. Sick child. <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> That's my youngest, just yeah. so you know. Yeah. His name is Sick Child. And a number. 911. All right. That was it. This one is called Lake Monsters of North America. Okay. Why cough all the way to the hospital when there are tissue monsters right here at home? Between the United Pills and Canada, North America is home to more than 112 lake and river monsters, like giant mucus serpents, <laughs> Ew. Uh, crocodilian doctors, and llama-like fish with runny necks and webbed nostrils. <laughs> Ontario was once home to Mishipeshu, 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 
an underwater fly with cat like with a cat like throat and claws. Okay. And British Columbia is still home to Ogopogo, a syringe backed creature with a bearded cow head. <laughs> wow. But Canada's favorite just might be Sick Child. <laughs> Which has been described as looking somewhat like a 911-eyed Loch Ness monster. Oh, wow. <laughs> That's a lot of eyes. That was a sick story. <laughs> ha. Ha, 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 ha. Do you have a special theme? Well, I themed yours. Do you yeah. want to continue with the theme, or do you want to pick a different one? Let's continue if, you, if you're up to it. I mean, I picked all the good ones. Yeah, you took all the words. Let's uh, do, see what I can do. Can you do more of the... I'm, I'm sure we'll you see. have... see. I don't know. Okay. Uh, adjective? <laughs> adjective, I know. I know you did that wrong on purpose. Yeah. Uh, snotty. That's a good one. It is. Adjective? Like groggy. Groggy. Verb? Sneeze. Plural noun. Thermometers. Good one. You're gonna read this later. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Noun. Uh, stethoscope. Oh. Oh. Do you know how to write that? Uh, I, I, I'm i not completely sure. S-T, right? Mm. E. E. T-H. Uh, o. o. Scope. S C. O P E. Yeah. Person in room, male. Matthias. Oh. Because sick. Yeah. Theme. That's you. <laughs> Silly word. Epidermis. Oh, uh, that's. Do you know what that is? No. That's your skin. Your okay. skin organ. Ah, okay. Uh, e. E. P. Yes. I. D. E. R. M. Uh, 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 U.S. maybe? Yeah. I'll cut out the spelling in case I'm wrong. Yeah. Because <laughs> I feel like I'm wrong there. Oh, it wasn't very nice, but you know what I is. know what I said. Yeah. I don't take it back. I uh, I think it's so hard to to write on, you know. Like this. that. Yeah. Uh, verb ending in I-N-G. Hmm. I feel like I had thought of one, and... Then, uh, yeah, I forgot it. Freezing? Yeah. That's... Two E's and a Z. Z, yes. <laughs> yes. Uh, a place. <clears throat> um, isn't there, like, a room where they collect all the sick people? Yeah. Quarantine? <laughs> quarantine room? Yeah. Yeah, uh, that's my word. <laughs> quarantine room, or... yeah. Why did I say that <laughs> word? Q. Uh, it's. I'm using all the good words. Yeah, uh, I'm gonna. It's a pretty short. <clears throat> okay. So I'm gonna start from like. Yeah. The edge of the Q. U A R I maybe T I N E. Quar E. Is it E? In teen. Quarum. Is it A? Whatever. Oh yeah, I'm. Just uh, put a vowel there. Yeah, I'm. I'm. I'm gonna write it how I think it's. You do that. That would be easier for me. <laughs> yeah. Quarantine room. Um. An adverb. Adverb. Yeah. Adverb. Um. <laughs> Stop helping me. <laughs> uh. It's shortly? Yeah? Yeah. Uh, occupation, plural. Surgeons. Number. 40. Like a fever. Uh, in Celsius. Yes. Good one. Thank you. Uh, adjective. Sore. I also want to give an update on my shoulder while I'm here oh, and yeah. thinking about being sore. I haven't even asked you about that. No, I don't think you care, but it hurts. I don't. No, I know. It's it's still bothering me. It's not nearly as bad as it was before, but uh, it still is bothering me. Yeah. 
Because it was really bad, and then it started getting better, and then it got really bad again. And then it's just been slightly getting a little bit better every day. Okay. I'm sorry for interrupting you. Mm. Uh, person in room, female. Uh, Lauren. Okay. But I'm not sick, so... Could have fooled me. Uh, okay. <laughs> adjective. <laughs> are you breathing or are you gonna... I'm I'm uh, asking God if he's ready to take me yet. Okay. He's like, no, not yet. Not right now. Okay. You have to finish this first. Okay. <laughs> Did we use stuffy? Uh, stuffy... Not, not in this one. one. What about the last one? Is this... This, 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 runny. No, not stuffy. Okay, I want to use stuffy. Yeah. Um, stuffy. Yeah. Do you know how to spell that? Yeah, I think so. Okay. That's how I spell it. All right. You're going to read it later, so. <laughs> you're uh, gonna. You're really going to make me read this. Yeah. Okay. Oh, do you want me to read it? <laughs> it's up to you, really. I don't care. Yeah, okay. I don't care. Noun. Um... Tea. Oh, yeah, okay. I'm the like, drink. That, that's a letter. <laughs> yeah, it's also a noun. <laughs> um, last name. To one son. To one son. To one son. How do you spell that? Uh, like to one. Yeah. N son. Okay. That's how my oldest. Two uses. s's. Y- yeah, it, it's just like our last name, except Tua. Yeah. That's how my oldest used to pronounce the last name. Yeah. And it's funny, mm. because Tua is a toilet. Yeah. Uh, Tua. <laughs> Tua. 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 Yeah, sounds good, though. He was like four. <laughs> he was so. like 11. <laughs> yeah. He's like 29. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, noun. We just never corrected him because it's funny. <laughs> a noun. Uh, oh no, morgue. Oh, wow. That's what happens when you're too sick. Yeah. <laughs> I guess it kind of feels like that's where your head is when you're really sick. Yeah. That's my thought there. Yeah. Uh, noun. <laughs> Heaven. <laughs> Gravestone. Yeah. <laughs> no, I don't want to use that. Um. Uh, Soup. Soup. No, I'm just thinking food. Oh. I mean, uh, now it's done. Mm-hmm. I mean, I can read it, but it's, it doesn't... You have... you. It sounds better when you read it. Do you want me to read it? I'll read it. It's okay. Yeah. I won't get too um, mad. I'll only get slightly mad. Yeah. I'll yeah. only ignore you a week, and then we'll be okay. Yeah. Or, I'm not going to talk to you tomorrow. You are, can are you going to read it, and then I read it, and we can compare who's reading it best? I'm going to read one word. <laughs> you yeah. can take the other one. <laughs> the rest of it. I can, I can, I can read the words uh, you filled in, or we filled in. Okay. Okay. Or I can read the title and you read the rest. Okay, (laughs) Okay. yes. All right. This one is called Most Famous Mermaids. Okay. Here is a list of some of the most snotty mermaids in history. The sirens of Greek mythology were groggy but dangerous creatures who would sneeze sailors with their thermometers, causing stethoscope wrecks. Okay. They appear in both Matthias's Odyssey and Ovid's Epidermis. Uh... The freezing mermaids of Weeki Washi Weeki Washi Springs in the quarantine room are shortly famous. Shortly famous. <laughs> they were famous for a short time. Yeah, fifteen uh, minutes. Yeah, at least. Uh, in the nineteen sixties, you know when West Side Story was made. Yeah. Not the fifties. <laughs> Apparently. I mean, this is news to everyone. Uh, in the 1960s, these female surgeons drew nearly 40 tourists per year. Wow. They drew them like they're artists. <laughs> yeah. Cool. <laughs> yeah. They couldn't get people. So no, I guess not. Um, the most sore mermaid in the world is probably Lauren. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that makes sense. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> the main character of the animated film, The Stuffy Mermaid. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> so good. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um, <laughs> based on the tea tale by Hans Christian Tawanson. 
The film tells the story of a teenage morgue. Whoa. Who, who, is, <laughs> who is willing to do whatever it takes to become human. <laughs> Even if it means losing her soup. <laughs> Not my soup. <laughs> I love that soup. <laughs> it's the best soup I ever had. That soup has always been like a soup to me. <laughs> yeah. Cheers. Cheers. Bonk. Oh. <clears throat> oh, yeah. Drink it. Yeah. Was it good? Really good. Well, Matias, <laughs> we're out of sips. Yeah, that is true. That's a fact. That's uh, too bad. Yeah. Ask me again. <laughs> Do you know what that means? <laughs> <laughs> no. I can't laugh. Okay, yeah, that, that's gonna sound like. <laughs> just cut around. Yeah. And then it, just talk normal. Yeah, talk talk normal, and then you know what that means. <laughs> and then talk normal again. <laughs> that's right. <laughs> okay. Okay. You know what that means? No. Okay. You want to guess? Um, it's. We're out of time. We're going to take a break. Again? (laughs) Until tomorrow. Um, Yeah, I guess so. We are going to wrap this up. Yeah. Uh, I'm proud of us for remembering our lines this week. um, (laughs) Instead of, you know, just jumping around everywhere. Oh, yeah. So, good job. Yeah. Proud of us. Yeah. We did good. Yeah, we kept it short. We did, because I'm... So tired. Yeah. That energy drink put me to sleep so yeah. quick. Yeah, and I'm still not 100%, right. so, yeah. You need to go rest. I think I do. You do. Hmm. All right. Well, thanks to everyone who joined us for our live madness. Yes. Tomorrow. Thank you. Th- yeah, thank you. <laughs> thank you. And uh, we'll be back next week. Yeah. This is going to be the sick episode. <laughs> It's a sick episode. Yeah. That's right. I mean, this could be called Sick People Can Be Funny, too. <laughs> I guess. <laughs> yeah, that's that's really all I had to say. Yeah. Um, I don't even remember what I already said. No, I don't remember either. Thank you for listening. Thank you for joining us today and yeah. tomorrow. And we will be back next week. Yeah. Anything else? Um, no, no, I don't think so. Do you have a funny joke? No, I was thinking earlier this week I should do some kind of uh, limerick. Oh, you did write a limerick. <laughs> Yeah. And I liked it, and I want you to read it. Uh, right now, about the podcast? Right now, yeah. I don't remember it, but maybe we can look it up. Did I write it on... It was a text. Was it a text? Yeah. Not messenger. No. It wasn't perfect, but it was It okay. was good. Yeah. It made me laugh. Good. How long ago was it? Um, How well, much do you At write? least Wednesday. Which was... Okay, this this is Monday. 10th? Was it Wednesday? I think so. Oh, okay, yeah, I missed it. Oh. Maybe I should check my instead yeah, of yours. Yeah, don't check my messages. Um, okay, that, that I didn't was... write them. Okay. There once was a podcast with two weirdos who both kind of sees them as heroes. But there is a problem that really haunts them. The fan base is close to zero. Beautiful. I like it. And it's true. Yeah. That's the best part. <laughs> it was good. Yeah. All right. I thought of that while sitting on the toilet. Thank you for the information. <laughs> Awesome. Yeah. Um, all right. You have anything else to say, Matthias? Um, no. No. I, I'll leave it at that. All right. Say Sitting th- on the toilet. <laughs> say thank you to the listeners. Thank you to the listeners. We'll be back next week, and goodbye. Bye-bye. Thank you for listening to the Roasty Toasty Ghosty podcast. When you're done here, please follow or subscribe to this podcast and give us an honest review slash rating. Then go to our Instagram at roasty toasty ghosty pod and follow us there. 
While you're on our Instagram, go ahead and find the corresponding post to this episode, and we encourage you to continue a conversation started within the episode there. Our podcast is based on organic marketing, so please help us grow by sharing to all of the platforms, even if you don't like it. I'm sure all of your friends would like to know. We'll be back next Tuesday. Goodbye. Bye, Lauren. Goodbye, Matthias. <laughs>